cycling, Europe's most popular sport and pastime. Cyprus, a winter refuge for cyclists as well as for many other outdoor activities. Cyclists from all over Europe come to Cyprus in the southeastern corner of the Mediterranean during their respective countries' cold seasons to spend a few weeks on the saddle in pursuit of their favorite pastime, either in simply touring the island or even in training for their favorite sport. Welcome to Cyprus. Winters in Cyprus are exceptionally mild, with daytime highs averaging 17 to 20 degrees centigrade, leading to ideal conditions for cycling. One thing you'll never get bored of in Cyprus is precisely cycling. The continuous and flowing change of scenery will keep you going, even if your legs can't. The many different ground textures lead to challenging and interesting variations, with each kilometer being different, seemingly changing under your very tires. In less than an hour, you can find yourself from the seashore up on the mountains. by the four legs. Cyprus's countryside is an open vista of antiquities and monuments, as well as villages presenting an admittedly unique local architectural inheritance. In these villages, one can't help but take in the renowned hospitality of the Cypriot people. The first thing you need to know when cycling in Cyprus is to do so on the left side of the road. Secondly, and particularly for the more free-spirited, there are no legal obstacles as regards cycling in open spaces. You're free to cycle anywhere your heart pleases, except of course on the motorways. Quite a few agencies specialize in cycling tours, both guided and unguided, and bicycle rental. There's also a number of shops offering both maintenance and spare parts. Cycling from dawn to dusk and even into the evening with the enchanting full moon as your escort. From there on, of course, this being Cyprus, there opens before you a colourful world of fun, quality and entertainment to see you through into the night. Cyprus cuisine, featuring both local and international dishes, is always at your service to satisfy your gastronomic desires. <laughs> Training camps for cycling cadets are also organized. Here, young cyclists under the supervision of expert coaches 
will get to know the fundamentals of their sport. In addition, safety, both on and off-road, is very well taught. Learning and having fun are two things that in training camps, and no pun intended, go in tandem. Information on children's camps may be obtained directly from the organizers, the Cyprus Cycling Federation. Cyprus's racing calendar begins in early January with both road and mountain bike races. Cyclists from other countries participate in these races as part of their training program on the island. The racing schedule tops off in late February with a series of international calendar races the most famous of all being the Avksentia. 20 seconds. 15 seconds. The Avksentia is a three-day race held in stages, in which top cyclists from all over the world take part, since it's considered a significant test for the big World Cup races that lie ahead of them. As all good things come to an end, however, so do your cycling holidays. Know this, though. You will never get enough of Cyprus on a pedal. <laughs> 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 Until next time, and hoping to see you soon. Bye-bye. They make a uh, excellent type of cheese halloumi. Oh, yes, it's very good. You taste it? Yes. Salut, Cyprus!